Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing well and having a lovely day. Thank you so much for joining me today. I have got a rather exciting haul today because this is my first ever, 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 ever Timu haul. I've had a few parcels arriving. I think everything is here now and I am so excited to go through it with you all and show you everything because honestly, I am shook. I am shooketh. I'm sure in the last couple of years we have all heard of Timu. It's completely exploded and I've heard so many good things. A lot of you guys and a lot of friends absolutely rave about it. So for a while I have been meaning to give it a go. So I'm really excited to finally have some bits from there to show you, show you what it's like, kind of tell you what the pictures look like compared to what arrived, that kind of thing. So Timu are very, very kindly sponsoring today's video, but of course, as always, I'm gonna be completely honest with you about what I think of everything that I've got in today's haul. Also very kindly giving me a code and a link to share with you guys, which can get you 100 Timu coupons. So I'm gonna put any information that I have for that on the screen right now and also in the description box below so you can just click straight through after this video. I now have the Timu app kind of addicted to the team up now, I'm not gonna lie, I've already made some more purchases for myself. Um but yeah, it's best to use the Timu app if you're gonna shop. It's just a much like smoother, easier experience than um just on a web browser. So I would definitely recommend getting that. Let's just jump in with something that I have been using every single day since it arrived because it is so so handy. You know me, I love a bit of storage. I got this. Obviously it did not come with the charms inside, they're part of my business, um, but it is this acrylic, um, hopefully there's not too many finger mark, fingerprint marks on the front, I have been using it constantly, acrylic storage for all of my charms, when I say all of my charms, these are just some of them, um, for those of you that don't know, I make charm necklaces, so I had some pretty good plastic boxes with, um, like little compartments in and you had to lift the lid up. I had about six of those stacked. So basically when there was charms that I needed in the bottom box, I had to lift them all off, lift the lid up. Obviously it's no issue, but this has been a game changer. It's so much easier. It's actually smaller than those boxes, but they have so many layers in them. I can fit so many more charms in. The problem with the boxes I had before as well is I had to slot in the dividers and then when the box moved around, the tiny charms would go underneath the dividers and then they weren't organised, so it's actually kind of pointless. But these ones, let me just show you. You can tell I'm very excited about this, I'm very into it. I'm just going to show you in a drawer. So this is, hopefully you can see that, basically what one of the drawers looks like and there's five of these. Um, so I think you get one, two, three, four, 24 um, in each tray. They're quite small, so perfect for beads or charms or any little things like it could even be a really nice jewelry box and you could put your earrings your rings in your necklaces and just keep them all separate like there's so many different uses for it um but yeah this is perfect for me and all of the sections are like solid so they ain't going nowhere um i have ordered myself some more of these because as i said that will not house all of my charms i have hundreds of different charms and obviously i want to divide them into different each individual one so I've ordered some more and I think they're going to look really really nice on my desk I think I probably need about four at the moment and that will probably go up so yeah I'm absolutely thrilled with that lovely quality really really handy and like I said would be so good for so many different uses next up I got this really beautiful little vase I loved the shape of it I believe they do it in another size and I think this might be the smaller one there may be a larger one um but I was really impressed with the quality of the packaging that this came in. So it came in the box in a big Timu bag, but I've kind of ripped that open now. Um, and then this was like the padding inside. So I'm so impressed that this is obviously not broken. Nothing came broken actually. And it's all in one piece, all intact. So um, I'm not sure how well it's coming up on the camera, but it's kind of like a speckled cream white vase. And I just thought this would look so pretty in our living room with some flowers in like I can when I have fresh flowers in the garden I can cut them it's kind of a dream at the moment but one day um yeah I absolutely love that now this haul as you will be able to start seeing is very very girly I wanted to just like treat myself to a few cute bits and bobs so yeah this is a super duper girly haul one thing that I got which I am so in love with I can't even tell you, and I, again, I'm going to need to order another one. 
is this little bag. I love quilted stuff, I love floral stuff, and would you believe it, it's a quilted floral bag. Um, it's just open, so it doesn't have a zip or anything. It would have been nice if it had a zip, but it's just quite a casual bag. It does have a pocket here, which would be good for your phone, and then it has a zip as well, which is perfect if you do want to store anything like your purse or money. Like, it's quite... Yeah, it's quite large, a large pocket. It's a really lovely size. I think you can probably get larger ones, but I really just love it. It feels really nice. It's a soft cotton material. It doesn't feel cheap or look cheap at all. It's all been embroidered. And then on the front, it I, it says something in French, which I'm just one of you can translate for me. And I will say this very poorly. Je suis très content de vous voir frais to avec amour don't know what that means i will probably google it in a little while but yeah i am obsessed with this they've got all different patterns and prints and there's a few more that i like so now that i've seen how nice it is i'm gonna grab another one this would be so handy like just for days out with the kids to chuck all their stuff in there if i go to a boot fair because i love myself a boot fair or a charity shop this would be a really nice bag to just pop things in i love that so much so impressed with that. I'll show you another bag that I picked up. Grab this one. Is it a bag? Yeah. So this one, you may sense a bow theme here. Dolly Bobo is is back, baby. <laughs> I do love my bows. I always have done. This is kind of like a tote, like a almost like a string bag. Um, the top's like a crochet material, and. Yeah, it's knitted. It's really cool. I really like it. Again, be a really handy bag just to have to take out with you to pop all your purchases in, stop you buying. Like, I'm always forgetting bags and then getting plastic bag or plastic bags or paper bags from the shops when I could have just taken my own little bag. So I really like like this. It's so so pretty. I love this bow design. It's very girly. This one is a little bit random, but that's kind of the beauty of Timu. There's so many different things you can buy on there. There is a bit of everything, I'm sure. You could find it on there if you're looking for something. I got an electric iron, like a mini iron. And I got it in cream, obviously. The reason I picked this up was I just thought it would be a really handy thing for if we go on holiday to just pack. Obviously, you can just change the plug. So it's got the... British Euro, no not Euro, UK plug, um, which you could just change up, but good to note that that's how it comes if you're shopping in the UK, because it could have easily had like a European or American plug on it or something, and it's just a really small dinky little iron, I guess you just press that down for the steam, um, it'd also be just handy to have upstairs if I just want to quickly iron one thing maybe before I go out. I have been known to use straighteners before and that's not the best idea. So yeah, it comes with the little water filler upper thing. It's really cute. So they do that in other colours as well. Oh, and there's also, that's good, a little plate for you to stand it on that way. <laughs> yeah, so that's cute. Got that. Never thought I'd say an iron is cute, but it is actually very cute. Picked up a couple of phone cases. These are so affordable on Timu. Um, let me just get them out and show you. So these are a little bit like bent, but I think once I put them on my phone, they would mould to the shape of my phone because they're like a plasticky rubber. So I went for this one, which is so pretty. It's like iridescent with flowers. And they look hand drawn. It's really cute. But it's like, it's a little bit bent. But I just would need to probably just pop it on my phone and like let it mould to the shape of the phone, if you know what I mean. And then I've been looking for one like this for ages. It's just really simple. But it's like a cream. Like a, it, it reminds me of a cloud. It's just like curvy and cute. So I picked those up, like I said, really, really inexpensive. Then. I don't know if you guys are going to think I've kind of gone crazy, but lately, you might have seen over on my Instagram, this year I've been really into wanting to create a doll's house. Like more, obviously the kids could use it, but it's actually more of a hobby for me, I think, to be honest, because I want to do it. I think it's because we've renovated a lot of our house now, so I kind of want another project, but don't want to move. <laughs> so I thought a doll's house would be 
amazing to be able to decorate so i've been looking into all of that getting bits and bobs looking at dolls houses that kind of thing but on timu they have these little mini sets you can get so so many um but these are like miniature dolls houses now there's a sticker on the front so i can't show you exactly what it looks like maybe i'll just put a picture up here from on the website but basically i think i ordered the yeah the sweet shop and there's like little chairs tables cakes sweets and then inside basically you get instructions and it is very intricate it's not like a quick thing where you'd like clip it all together it does take a lot of work so like that is what is inside of it to make oh here's the picture to make this so i'm not saying it's going to be something that would be a quick job but if you just want a hobby you know like lego i guess i mean i know girls can do lego but this feels like girly lego to me there is girl girls lego but you know what i mean like there's light shades there's like oh my god there's so many tiny intricate pieces in this that's the kind of thing that just excites me i don't know why yeah there is a lot to it i just think when i get a bit of time to myself which to be honest isn't very often but out of an evening you could spend an hour making it put it away and just do it when you get a little bit of you time you know i don't know i just i'm drawn to doing something like that at the moment so i did actually get another one <laughs> this one's actually bigger um so you can get all these different ones and i got this one which is like a mint color and obviously it's really tiny so yeah i don't exactly know how it will turn out but like you get that in there which is plants and flowers for the garden you get a ruler you get actually a lot of tools in these that one had a a scalpel type of knife um yeah they're all the bits to the house so i don't know let me know what you think do you think i've gone crazy or would you actually be up for making mini dolls houses as well it honestly feels like christmas um it's like i don't know what i'm gonna pull out next obviously i have looked at everything i'm not gonna say that i've not checked everything i have looked at everything but yeah i'm just so excited oh my god this is so pretty okay so look at this little cup Again, I have a thing at the moment. I have really girly cups. I think maybe it's because I live with all boys. Maybe I'm rebelling. But I, I have now quite a cute collection of little hand-painted cups that they can all use, but they don't because they're girly. Um, so they're like my special cups for cups of tea and stuff. And I just thought this one was adorable. I love like the shape of it, the irregular shape. It's got flowers. It's got cherries. So pretty. I mean, I don't think I'd be putting that in the dishwasher or anything like that but it's just beautiful and again it came in the box not broken so i'm really really impressed with that the good thing as well is they do 90 day returns which i think is amazing i think they're 90 day free returns and it's free delivery as well so just another added bonus um let's have a look what's in here some of these i have forgot what is inside because i opened this the other day oh i got this a really cute little swan ornament again i thought it was really girly i thought it looked lovely in our bedroom or somewhere dotted around the house it's just a small little swan i've actually been looking at for one in the charity shops for ages and just haven't found one so this one when i saw it looked perfect just quickly back to the doll's house i also did pick up these papers which are i think they're like scrapbooking papers and stuff but they would make perfect doll's house wallpaper maybe not for those tiny ones because they're like very small um and i think they come with all of that kind of stuff anyway but when i eventually do like the bigger project i thought this kind of thing could really come in handy so like this one is a bigger pack of paper obviously you could use it for different crafts as well can i show you these at all see like there's all different different ones in there so i thought that would be cute i've probably got another one in there somewhere but i'll find it at some point i picked up this which is a little tablecloth do you know what i think it is as well i think it's like the bridgerton vibes when bridgerton comes back in i i turn into like wanting to be like an i don't know like a, a lady or a duchess or something <laughs> i just love it but anyway i got this linen look floral tablecloth i just thought in the summer that would look really beautiful obviously across the middle of the table with white plates and um, a cake stand and stuff 
so that was really gorgeous again it feels really nice quality it does need an iron so i can use my my mini iron on that but you could you could like maybe no maybe not i was gonna say iron it on the table but i've done that before and actually ruined a tablecloth so don't do that I did actually get some clothes because i wanted to see what they were like so this is the first time i'm getting this out this is a little t-shirt it says girls do it better and it's of course got a bow on the front um, I've got a medium because I think sometimes sizes does cut, sizing comes up a little bit on the smaller side but actually it's quite it's not large but it's definitely not like a tiny medium if that makes sense it seems like a true to size medium um, but yeah I'm glad I went for this size and I really love the colour it's just like a really pretty corally bright pink perfect for the summer so I picked that up then I got this. This might be like my only, I guess, fail. Um, I thought, I don't know what that, oh, that's, that's a little stand that it comes with. So I thought this was in um, like an actual frame and I probably just haven't read the description properly. But basically it's like a little hydrangea painting, but it's all made out of wood. So it's all one piece. This isn't a separate frame. Um, and I just assumed that it came in like an arch frame. But it actually looks really cute. I think this would look really nice as wedding decor as well. If you're going for quite a classic, traditional, maybe like Bridgerton vibes wedding. Um, it's nice. It just wasn't what I thought it was. But I think looking back at the picture, that's my bad. Um, I really love the print inside though. I wish I had that sort of on a canvas or something because I, I love hydrangeas and I just thought that was very pretty. What is in here? I also got this. I've wanted one of these for so long. I've just probably seen them on Instagram and now I've been um, influenced. But it's a little cowboy boot and what people usually do is pop matchsticks in there. So it's a little matchstick holder. I mean, you could easily pop like a couple of tiny little flowers in there next to a bigger vase and that would look really cute or you could put your pen in there on your desk but yeah I think I'm going to pop matchsticks in there and that will be really cute. Another item of clothing or set should I say I picked up this I'm sure this came in loads of colours so it's a really cute little set I got I'm obviously just loving pink at the moment so I went for the bright hot pink perfect for this time of year nice length nice like wide leg and then this is the top that comes with it so again need to get my mini iron out but it's like a little wrap top so it just goes on like that it's got the frill at the bottom and then you tie it at the back this would be so cute on holiday i'm absolutely re i'm really impressed with this it's got adjustable sleeves actually that seems like it's the back because of where the bra straps are so i think maybe you tie it at the front not at the back but maybe you could maybe you could wear it the other way i'm not sure because yeah you could just pull those back sorry i do this i like faff around um but yeah that's really pretty i'm very impressed with that the quality of that's nice um then i got this sorry this is so random but hopefully the girliness is giving like a thread of a theme here instead of just all the random things this I got for my office and it is a little pen organiser. Oh, what's that? They always come with like extra little things. This is some kind of sticky, maybe you pop it on the bottom to stop it slipping around on the desk. That's a good idea. So basically it comes with this and you can just have it like that if you wanted to. But obviously this organises all your pens and then all makeup brushes and then it has like the lazy susan turny element on it as well um they do this in cream kind of do wish i got the cream but the pink is really pretty that would look so nice on a dressing table with makeup brushes in like i said or makeup or pens so i grabbed that it's plastic i got some girly socks oh these are so adorable so they've got flowers on them hopefully this is focusing okay so i've got the they're like ankle socks flowers bows bows plain bows yes i am aware that i am acting like an eight-year-old girl right now but i don't care these are really cute i love those next i found these which i'm very excited to try i'm gonna get them out of the plastic so you can hopefully see them a little bit better again it's come with the tools 
which I think is really good for the value, um, for the price, sorry. So they are nail stickers, but they have all of these beautiful little flowers on them. So you paint your nails, it says on the back, clean the surface of the fingernail, remove the art carefully with the forceps, or tweezers, um, stick the art on and apply a top coat, finished. Adorable. And I, my nails are growing out now, but they're white, and I reckon they would look really nice on a white background for summer. I really hope I can do them, they're very delicate. I think if you pop a top coat on over the top, it would be absolutely fine. So I got those, and I think they do, again, like loads of different things. Whatever you fancy as nail stickers, they would look nice. Um, another one of those Doll's House wallpaper sets. Behind them is all different. Um, there's loads of different ones in there, so I don't necessarily like that front one, but there were nice ones, and it shows you on the website like what you're buying. Then I got these, which again, I haven't got out and put together, so maybe we should just do that now, so it gives you the full effect. So basically what this is, is a faux coffee table or bookshelf book. So if you love the look of coffee table books, but they're not quite in your budget, or you just don't want to spend that much, because they are expensive, especially if you're just using it as decor and you're not actually going to read it, you can get, in all different sizes and like book covers, these... Book, but you can actually use them for storage as well for a start because you can open that part um i need to stick it all down it comes with a little double-sided tape bit there but basically it goes like that and then it looks like a book when you stack it and you can pop things on the top so i just think that's a really really great idea like i said you can get all different ones and i've got loads of coffee table books so it might be nice to just bulk those out with something that's a little bit more cost effective so i've got that then I ordered some beads. Look how many beads you get in this pack. They're such pretty colours. I don't get much time to like bead because I'm always making charm necklaces, but I thought it would just be nice if I do get a chance. Or maybe I could even include them in some designs. Um, they're really, really gorgeous as those of iridescent colours, pastel colours. You also get the like jump rings and the like plasticky cord. I wouldn't really use these, especially if I was designing things to sell but um yeah if you're wanting wanting to do it for fun it's really good that you get those as well and i love the little organizational case very nice got that. girls i got <laughs> another bow item i can wear my bow socks and my bow top and my bow hat how cute is this so I might need to like wear it to make it the right sort of shape and size. Does it fit? I need to kind of like wear it in, I think, and also make it a little bit tighter. <gasps> Cute! I love that! I never have baseball caps. But how could you resist one so cute and girly? They do also have them like cream with the pink bow and stuff. I actually really love that. Probably ruined my hair now, but... Might need a little bit of an iron on the sides where it's been folded up, but it's really nice. It's really lovely with the embroidery. And then I got this cute little frame. Again, I feel like it's very Bridgerton. I actually really like the little print inside. That's cute. That's This is kind of what I was thinking that other frame was, a little bit more of like an ornate frame. But this one is a real frame, so of course you can put your own picture in there, or you could put some vintage art or leave that in there. And it's just, it's very sweet, isn't it? I really, really like that. I also found this wooden bowl, which I thought was a really great find. It's beautiful. Again, I think they had different sizes. So maybe you could get one that's a bit large. You could use it as a fruit bowl or something. This would be a nice bowl for our like um, hallway table to chuck keys and stuff in or just bits and bobs that just get thrown, you know, on the side when people come in. Like a little catch all bowl. It feels, again, it feels really nice quality. I'm very, very impressed with that. And then again, random purchase, but I just couldn't resist because it was cute. This is a little rechargeable, is it? No, I think it might be battery. Yeah, battery operated, little light. And it was just so sweet. I think it's a scalloped edge on it. It looks like a little flower light and you can get them in pink as well and other colours. And then you can just clip it on to maybe like your bedside table or somewhere maybe there's like a little reading light i think they're also made to clip onto a kindle to read um yeah just all different things but it's a cute little little thing to have i, I really like that 
So that is just about everything that I wanted to show you today. My first Timu haul definitely won't be my last. I really, really, really love everything that I got. It's so nice. Um, yeah, go and check it out if you haven't already. You might be very pleasantly surprised. Like I said, in my description box below, I've got a link and a code that will get you 100 Timu coupons. Um, it's free delivery, free 90 day returns, and they also accept like all the major credit debit cards, they accept the pay later services like Klarna, etc. Um, so there's definitely going to be something on there that catches your eye um, and that you'll be pretty impressed with, I'm sure. Thank you so much for watching today's video. I'm sure I'll be back with another Timu haul very, very soon because I think I'm addicted now. Um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. Let me know what your favourite items were. Give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you in another video very soon. Bye, guys.